like 90s cool guy way of sitting in a chair. It's actually perfect for painting. Give us your best smile. <laughs> I am Danny Larson, and I'm an artist. All right, let's go to the studio. Yeah, let's go. This is the subway to work. <laughs> the main idea behind my paintings and my artwork is that you're, a, you're, you're supposed to be able to see beauty and something amazing anywhere. The whole reality, everything you see, everything you experience, everything is subjective, nothing is objective every mundane little thing that you pass each day. So my main inspiration is basically day-to-day -day life. Yeah. Yes. All right, so That's this hard. is it. All right, welcome to the studio. This is actually one of the first drawings I did after I decided I wanted to focus on art. Since I was a kid, I always, I always drew. As soon as I finished high school, I kind of had to decide what I wanted to do. Like, do I want to pursue art or do I want to pursue snowboarding? I got the opportunity to become a pro snowboarder, but I still kept like my art interest alive at the same time. I never did contests that I only did like filming and photography. So I only focused on the aesthetic part of snowboarding. You're supposed to surprise the viewer. Yeah, try to come up with something they haven't seen before, something that kind of stands out, something that's special. You learn to see and look at your surroundings in a way that other people don't. And so I kind of brought that mindset from snowboarding into art. If you're gonna do a job like this, where you do something that's kind of hard to fathom, and like, it's definitely difficult to do. If you have a chair that makes it comfortable for you to sit for like seven, eight hours straight, that's gonna make the job easier to do. Yeah, so, <clears throat> so we made it kind of a tradition when we had like a show in Oslo or something like that, that we bring it, a bottle of champagne up to that cliff just to be really poncy artists. And then we sit on the edge and then have a bottle of champagne and take a look at the view and just realize that we actually have a pretty cool life and we're pretty lucky to get to do what we do. Oh